Hey guys, my name is Scoby and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to enable or disable automatic updates on your PlayStation 5. This is going to be a nice, quick and easy tutorial. I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do everything. Let's jump right into this. So what we need to do is have our PlayStation 5 on our dashboard. We need to be logged in. Once we're here, what we're going to be doing is clicking up one and we're going to be clicking to the right three times until we get to our settings tab here on the top right. Once we're here, we simply need to click the X button to open this up. And here we can see some of our settings for our PlayStation 5. From this point, we're going to be scrolling down here until we see the system tab. It's currently here. Click the X button to open this up again. And here we're going to get some system information and settings for our PlayStation 5. From this point, we're going to be staying on this top option here on the left, system software. We're going to be clicking one to the right, and we're going to be coming to system software update and settings. If we click X to open this up, here we'll get some more information about our system software. We can see at the moment I'm currently up to date. We will then have two extra options and settings here. The first one being download update files automatically. So this will automatically download files when your PlayStation 5 is turned on or in rest mode. You can really easily disable this here. And the second one is to install update files automatically. Again, this will install your update files automatically in rest mode. Again, you can really easily disable this here as well, or you can really easily enable both of these here as well, depending on what you want to do. However, it's as easy as that to stop or start your PlayStation 5 from downloading and updating files automatically. Automatically. Anyway guys, it's as easy as that to enable or disable automatic updates on your PlayStation 5. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new, check out the other videos on the channel. I'm going to be leaving a link down below to my PayPal if you found these videos helpful and you want to support me. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching and until next time as always, keep it saucy, peace.